Drawing from Nature with Pamela Duffus. Lesson two, drawing a pepper. To begin, look at your pepper from different angles. Observe the pepper and draw the shape with a light pencil. If you make a mistake, don't worry about it. Just make a correction with your pencil. You can erase any lines you don't like at the end. To see the values, imagine your pepper is black and white. Follow the form of your pepper with the side of your pencil, building up the value from light to dark. Look at the shapes that the values form. This will help you create a three-dimensional pepper. Pay attention to your light source. Where is the highlight on your object? Where is your object a little bit darker? Noticing all of these things will make your pepper look more realistic. You can build darker values by using lines that are close together, pressing a little bit harder, and even overlapping your lines. When you begin to shade the stem, notice which way the light is hitting your pepper. If you shade the one side darker and leave the other side a little bit lighter, it's going to really give your pepper dimension. You also might have a cast shadow from the stem onto the pepper. So look very closely for something like that as well. Don't forget to add a cast shadow. This will help your object look like it's sitting on a surface and not floating in the air.
When you're ready to go even darker, switch pencils and try and use a softer one, maybe a 4B or a 6B. Use a kneaded eraser to pull out some bright highlights in the pepper. This will add more contrast to the pepper and make it look shiny. Go back and add those final touches and those darks and maybe some textures to your drawing and then you're all finished. Thank you for watching. If you're interested in viewing some more Drawing from Nature videos, please visit my YouTube channel, Pamela Duffus at YouTube. Thank you.